Hi, how you doing? My name is Locke. I'm from 2MCC TV. Today I'm going to show you how to export a video footage from the Milestone software. What you're going to do is you're going to click on your Exportech Smart Client and go ahead and log in. Once you log in, what you want to do is you want to click on the Playback tab. Let's go ahead and do that. And down here you're going to have a Start End Time icon. It's a little clock. So go ahead, click on that, and choose the date that you want to view. So right now, I'm going to choose September 17th on both of them. And then what you're going to do is you're going to type in the time of the time you want to back up. So I'm going to do 639. I'm just going to click OK. So what he's going to do is it's going to take me to the video footage that, um, that sh you know, I want to back up. So it takes me to 639. And what you have to do is go ahead and find the start time and end time. So, for example, um, instead of 639, I'm just going to move back to six, around 634. And I'm going to right-click at my start time. And I'm going to click time selection mode. So once I do time selection mode... I'm able to choose my end time. There's two brackets. The first bracket to the left is going to be your start time, and the second bracket is going to be your end time. So I start at 6:34. I'm just going to do a small clip for about a minute to 6:35. So once I do that, I'm going to right click and I'm going to click Export Selections. Now there's multiple options that I can back it up and I can back it up in an protect format where it gives you an embedded player. If you don't want that, you could choose the second option right here, which is media player format. Now this will export the video format and let you play it in Windows Media Player. Uh, before we, you choose the format, what you want to do is you want to name your file. So you could rename your file to whatever you want. I'm just going to name it test and the path you can choose the path where to save it to. So right now I'm just going to save it to my desktop just to make things simple. And then the second option is instead of saving it to a path, you can also burn it to a CD. If you are going to do that, you're going to choose Media Burner. The third selection right here is Cameras. What cameras do you want to view? Um, you can choose you know, auto camera, single camera, or multiple cameras. Right now I'm just going to choose one camera. Um, Earlier I explained the formats. I'm going to choose me a player format just to keep it simple. And then the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hit start export. You see up here it's going to give us a status of what it's doing. Right now it's exporting and it will give you status of when it's done as well. I get the sign that it's done uh, exporting my video footage. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit over to the desktop. I'm going to see a file that says test. Go ahead and double click on that. Open up the folders. It's listed camera 1 and double click on the video footage. And that's basically how you back up video footage using a Milestone Exprotect Smart Client. Thank you for watching this video and make sure you check out our other videos on our YouTube channel or our website at 2mcctv.com.